Nodi gang, Nodi gang, Nodi gang. In today's Madden 22 video, we're gonna be going over a few methods that you should be utilizing right now to make a lot of coins and then prepare for making even more coins in the next 24 hours. If you're new to the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video, hit that red subscribe button. 10K is right around the corner, about 60 subscribers away. Thank everybody that's been showing love and support. Let's get into today's methods. This is your one-stop shop for all Madden needs. Whether you're looking for some fly merchandise, you're looking for eBooks, you're looking for a Patreon membership, or you just want to become part of the Tutty Squad. I appreciate all the love and support. Everything is in the link in the description. Let's get it. All right, so the number one thing that you want to be taking advantage of is grinding your solos. That's all your Christmas solos if you haven't, because you can still receive presents even after the presents are out of the store. Last night, I finished the last two solos and I got random presents and I'm gonna put a clip right here. As you can see, we pulled a 91 overall after the presents were already out of packs. So make sure that you are taking advantage of your solos. That's gonna give you free training to use for the rerolls, which in turn turns into free coin. Also, I got this 94 overall Jerry Judy right here that you can quick sell for 4,750 training. Like I said, training, Reroll turns into free coins. You can't sell this card, but you can turn it into training. Roll, get a chance at 89 overalls, which go for 30 to 35K, or you can pull a limited over the next 24 hours, or you can pull some 93s. So playing your solos is super important. You can also go up in there, sell the power-ups. That's gonna be another 3,000 coins okay so make sure number one you are taking advantage of all your solos that give you an opportunity at profit number two every day you also want to come over here and do at least 15 of these get a player packs now they've been shooting out elites and golds recently you can use only about five six thousand coins and pull a lot of good stuff out of these which in turn you can turn into sets now that the market has went back up you can turn these cards into sets or you can sell them off individually. A lot of the silvers are going for three to 4K on certain teams like the Cowboys, the Raiders, all that. So you go up in here, you open up 15, 20 of these packs. That's gonna be between 5,500 and 6,000 coins. All these cards that you take out of this, like the 80 overalls, the 75 to 79 overalls, can go into sets that still have a big profit margin. The next method that you need to be taking advantage of is snipes, okay? As you can see, I only have 141,000 coins in the top corner, but I am loaded with 93 overall snipes because snow is still a very important currency. And once they put that QB, Derrick Henry, into PEX and another limited is gonna give you an opportunity rolling snow or training to pull something glitchy. They're gonna be going between 450 and 600 K coins. Right now, they were selling when they first came out of the packs, 400, 450,000 shot up last night. I seen about eight or nine sell for over a million coins. So that's gonna be an easy 450, 500,000 profit. And you know how much limiteds are jumping out of the packs. I pulled six of the last limiteds that was in packs. I think they went out today. So as you can see, I got 11, different 93 overall so you can snipe all these for 121 128 k depending on when you are online i have 11 of them now 121 128 k that you get these for once the limiteds hit the pecs the value is going to go way up so i can resell all these 93s back and roll the 91s into snow and I can make a lot of profit. All of these will go up to 155 to 160K. So I can make a 15, 20,000 profit on each one of these snipes 
that I got. Like I said, you want to spend between 125 and 130 thousand coins on each one of these they usually sell at the highest 148 to 150 so don't pay no more than about 132 133 k for these 93 now getting back to the sets that are very lucrative right now is the team of the week george kittle and then you also have the team of the week week 12 that makes a lot of coins is Patrick Sertain. Last night, they were both going for over 305,000 coins. Now, all you need is to have an opportunity in this 83 to 90 overall team of the week. If you can put the 183 to 84 in there and the 380 to 82s by opening up the 500 coin pack, you're gonna have the opportunity to knock the value off of this George Kittle. So in return, if you was to go up in here and you were to pull three or four different rolls, that's three to four different pieces, that gives you a chance to knock off about 20K up to about 70, 80, thousand coins off of that so if you can go in and spend two hundred thousand and in return sell him for three hundred and eight three hundred and nine thousand coins that's going to be the fastest 90 to 100k that you would make now we made three packs okay so in return you're going to end up playing solos you're going to get a daily coin pack that's going to help with your overall coin profit total or it's going to take off whatever coins that you spend throughout the day. Also, when you complete a set, when you open up a pack, that's gonna give you new XP when you back out and it's gonna give you 100 coins every single time. So that'd be another 200 coins. So if you're doing the 500 get a player pack for 500 coins, 500 coins, 500 coins, you are getting two to 300 coins free back in return. You play a couple solos, you're gonna get this daily coin pack in return you can get from 3,000 to 9,000 to 10,000 5,000 depending on what your luck is some of y'all might get 25,000 50,000 that's going to help with your overall tour what you spend so if we open up these three packs it's going to give us three opportunities just by opening up the get a player pack so that's an 83 overall sony michelle okay so that's the lowest possible that you can so as you can see he goes into the player of the week George Kittle, and he goes into the week 13 champion, Boomer Esiason. George Kittle is the highest selling card right now between him and the cornerback in week 12. So that's one extra piece that I have to worry about sniping. So if we go back to the last two packs, that right there is gonna take about 4,500 to 5,500 off of your initial price okay so that's good so we got two more packs if you can make at least four packs it makes your chances way better so we get another 83 right there and you're looking for something higher than an 83 but if you get three 83s or four 83s it's all good it's going to help with the total as we pull a 90 overall dallas golder okay so opening up the 500 coin pack gives you an opportunity to pull an 80 overall, the 75 to 79 overalls that you need. In return, you can sell this if you want to for 55,000 coins. Or you can come over here to the set and you can take that free card that you just got, okay? So right here, you can see we have one, two, three, we have four pieces all total, and we have one of the highest ones and one of the second highest ones. So what we have left is 50, 100,000, and then how much do these go for? So 15-ish, 14 that you can snipe them for. So 15, 30, 45K right there that we can put in. So 145K so far that we would have left. And then how much are these 83s? So 5,000-ish, you can probably snipe them for lure. So 5, 10, 15. So 145K left. And then 5, 10, 15. So 160, 165K that you are making this set for. Okay? I mean, you're spending another seven to 8,000 coins rolling the 500 coin pack to get an opportunity to get the low elites that you put into the set. So we're going to just say 175 to 180K total that you use to build this set just by using the method. 175, 180K is really lower than that, but that's what we're gonna use. All right, so we at 175K at the highest. Now, if we go over here to team of the week and we go to George Kittle, we're gonna see how much he's selling for right now. Prices probably went down a little bit, but as you can see, we're gonna go to tight end, George Kittle. 
Remember, we might spend 170, 175K. That's 100K profit that you would have been to made just by simply doing what I told you. Do the 500 coin pack. Take all the good pools, 74 overalls and higher, 80 to 82 overalls. The rest of them, you can sell off for profit. So to recap everything, you're going to go to the 500 coin pack every day. Okay, so you're going to come up here and you're going to roll this 15 to 20 times. Some of y'all could do 25 times to give you more of a shot at some good pools. Okay, now you're going to be spending 7 to 8 K. You're going to have your daily coin pack. That's going to give you back 5K. That's going to be for free just playing the game. So you're going to roll 20 to 25 times with a chance at building a lot of players. You're going to get 5,000 back out of the daily coin or even better. Okay? So that's going to look like you're not even spending anything and you got a chance at 25 players. You're going to take those 25 players. Those 25 players, you are going to move over to any kind of set or you can sell them off individually. So you have George Kittle, you have Patrick Satane, they are both selling for a lot. 275,000 is 275,000. Then you're gonna take all them little pieces that you got just by rolling the 500 coin quick sale, the ones that you don't sell off. If you get an 85 overall, an 86 overall, sell those pieces off for the 12, 15, 16K. But all the pieces that go into the set, you put them into the set, and then you make yourself at least three to four packs. Come back up in here, finish the set. You're gonna be finishing the set between 155 to 190, 200K. You're gonna be able to sell him back off for a 50 to 80K profit. As you've seen, the way that I did it, I pulled a 90 overall and I was able to finish this set if I wanted to for over a 95, 100K profit. Make sure that you take advantage of this. Number two, make sure that you are stacking your snow. Snipe as much snow as possible because on Monday, it's gonna be big time limited into packs and you're gonna to wanna to get lucky and pull a few of them. Thank you for all the love and support. If this tip helped you out, make sure that you drop a thumbs up on the video and I'll see y'all in 24 hours with another banging method.